Hello everyone. So today we are going to create this uh, infinite desert landscape using the world engine plugin we created. So we will have an infinitely generated desert landscape. So no matter where we go, there will be desert and you can go in any direction. So to demonstrate this here, let me speed up a little bit of the game so if you move further and further you see in the distance desert is generated as we go and there will be we will be able to fly over the landscape in uh, infinitely to whatever the direction we choose So if I land on the desert, we can walk too. Alright, so this is what we are going to work on today. How to create this infinite landscape, infinite desert landscape using the World Engine plugin. And before we get started, let me remind you that you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects I have done in my channel from my Patreon page. Once you become a member, you can access everything without any limits. And here is the runtime terrain generation tutorial series I did. This plugin is based on this tutorial series, so everything is explained here from scratch. You can also follow these episodes and implement everything you see here by yourself. So. I'll leave the link to the full playlist also in the description. Right, now let's get back to today's tutorial. So this is the map, default map I get when I download the World Generation, World Engine plugin. And when I play, you get this one. Okay. Here you can see all these trees. Uh, grass animals everything is procedurally generated and spawned and if you fly along the world uh, landscape will be generated infinitely so this is fine but what i want to create today is a desert landscape using this same plugin so uh world generation this is the map so let me just duplicate this world generation desert and save it and open it now here for starters let me remove this tired animal spawner and tired grass spawner because i don't need that and underworld engine I'll go here and I'll remove these foliage types. I don't need any foliages for the desert landscape. And then instead of, yeah, let me just play and now show you. This is what we get. And also we don't need a C for the desert. So here we have an option, enable C, remove that. And now this is what we have. So instead of this green landscape, all we now need is some desert sand material. Let's do that. And also we need to modify the shape of the landscape a little bit too. And also we need to match the atmosphere to look, make it look more like a desert. So first thing I can think of is maybe we don't need these volumetric clouds. So let me just delete that and then from fab uh, pixel sand red desert sand maybe you can add this to project uh, but feel free to use anything you prefer and here we have this material and here I changed this tile into point 2 and let me assign this to the world engine 
the rain material of a play why is it black oh lost base color texture uh, i'm not sure what went wrong but here let me restore that default color that one but this one should be the base color so let me assign that and add like this one ORM then normal okay save it now play it yeah see now we have the desert okay this is cool but it i don't i think it would be better if we make this uh, desert landscape a bit flatter so here under world engine settings we have options maybe this mountain height instead of this let's make it 10 this one also okay all right now it looks more flat i think this is better i reduce the mountain scale to this and this is how it looks now okay i think this is all right uh, now the next step is matching this uh, sky color this horizon to make it look more like a desert so maybe uh, let me play this so that we can get a clear idea and go to optional light this look for the light but for the sky atmosphere let me the color from this ground itself okay and then let's adjust it okay now it looks better here in the distance the land and the sky matches i think that's cool so make sure to copy this value because once you stop playing this will vanish you can go here and paste it oh the best And the I did some changes to the direction light too. Okay, play. All right. And the next thing is uh, we have a height fog also in the level. Let's see. Is this so if I want to match the color of this as well I can pick the color set it like this but maybe this is too much so yeah again it's all depend on the exact look you want to achieve 
what I think I like what I see in here I'm seeing here so yeah just like before make sure to copy all properties stop the game and go back paste all properties all right this is our infinite desert and if I go to the sky and if let me speed up so we can clearly see you see as we go further and further landscape is generated so we will have, we have and we have infinitely large uh, desert landscape and we can go in any direction we need so yeah that's all i want to do in this episode And thanks for watching. As always, updated project files will be available for download here in the Patreon page. Link would be in the description below. And let me know if you have any questions in the comments. See you in another episode. Goodbye.